All right, Amira, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, hit the Ripton. Can I just fast travel now? Because that would be awesome. Actually. Let's go. Pull up no. here. Let's have to have a terrain. of chill belt. My thanks, Avon. Have you seen Chelbelt? No, but we caught sight of Leovi fleeing across the river. He was chasing someone. It has to be Chelbelt. He is the only What's prize well worth with? taking in this mud sink.
Jailbound. He's in trouble. I won't back down, Leofrith. I will not. Don't make this hard. It has to be more. <laughs> Please! Huh. You do not want to do this. Leofrith! Let him walk. You answer to me. I answer to my king. Our silence deeds with this. Lay it by, Leofrith. There's nothing left to fight for. We've stormed Repton. Only a matter of time. I cannot do that. Then you will die. Someone will. Oh dear. You can't win this, Leofrith. Even if you defeat me, the Rachnesons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I am still standing. You cannot win! Lucky to stand in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die before I yield. Oh. Nope, failed that. All right, let's try that again. Please, you do not want to do this, Leofred. I laid back this. Okay. Even if you defeat me, the Rachnesons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I am still standing. Slowing. Bah! You are strung will pain. Herkrit was lucky. To stand in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die before I yield.
Then somewhat. Can't win this, Leopold. Even if you defeat me, the Ragnarsons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I'm still standing. How does it feel? Burgrid was lucky. To stand in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die before I yield. Finished. Not yet. Fight me, he You cannot win. to the death. I thought I lost. We both know how this goes. An honorable Thane fighting a dishonorable war. Burkrid abandoned him, betrayed his trust. If I were Leofrid, I would want to know. Why rob him of this last glory? A warrior ready to meet his god and bask in his praise. To live will only lead him to shame. It's not an oath he would keep if he knew the truth. Then choose. Truth or glory. Oh, shit. Stand, Leovrid. Live to fight another day. What? Your loyalty to Burkrid is not a loyalty returned. He resigned the crown and fled to Rome. He's gone. You lie. Lie to a man seconds from death? What would I gain? He saved himself and left you to die. All this fighting, it's for nothing. For no one. To betray one so trusted. So close. It's a dishonor worth a thousand deaths. 
Eivor, you have shown me a great kindness. It, it is only fitting that I do the same. At Venonis, there is a statue with a scroll laid in a small bowl. You must burn it. A scroll? Your name is on this scroll. At Burgred's request, I put it there. When it is found, the zealots who read it will hunt you. Who are they? It doesn't matter now. You haven't much time. Burn the scroll, or they will never stop hunting you. Where will you go now? Rome. Come on. Let's take you back. Careful. You're injured. I'm all right, really. A few nicks and cuts from the battle, that's all. These wounds will heal quickly. You're lucky. I threw myself at him, Eivor. But he only toyed with me. He knew I couldn't touch him. You should have stayed hidden. Tilbert, this wasn't your fight. It was. It was our fight. Yours, mine, my father's. I had to help. And you did. You showed courage today. Bravery. You are a boy no longer. No greater honor than to serve aboard like your with Leofric. sea steed, Eivor. I didn't think you'd spare him. There's no the honor in killing a man misled. He believed his king would die fighting for Mercia. He knows the truth now. And with that truth, he forges a new path. You were right about him, Chilbert. And right to believe the line that divides us can be thinner than it seems. Chieftain of your own clan with courage like that. No less than the King of Mercia, brother. One of these days. And how is my father taking to his new role? See for yourself. You are an Otlinger now. Or Athling, I think you'd say. Next in line for the throne. It's an honorable title. One that demands good judgment. Be careful who you trust. My son. Are you well? Yes, father. Well enough. He honored you today. Fought bravely against many stalwart foes. You have my thanks. All of you. And my blessing. We knew what this alliance might cost us. But it's over now. And everyone has gained something. Silver. Honor. Allies. Agreed. Today we turn a new page. All of England must know. The Kingdom of Mercia has a new king. The remaining kingdoms of England won't respect your path to power. Nor will many in my kingdom. Burgred's soldiers will stand tall in the face of this turmoil. All across Mercia, against us. That we shall remedy soon enough. I am riding for Oxenifordshire directly. ...to forge an alliance with some thanes there. Shall I go with you? Not till I know more. Linger here a while if you can. Strengthen our friendships. I will send for you soon enough. Sigurd... ...I would feel... ...better if... ...Chaelbert was... ...away from here until Mercia is more stable. Would you welcome him among your clan? Hmm... Do you have a horse, you madling? I do. A young steed called Theobald. Good. I can ride with you as far as the river Nene. You may find your way from there. Thank you, Sigurd. This puts my mind at ease. All right. Be ready for my call, Eivor. It will come. You and Sigurd make a good pair. The future of England will be pagan from top to bottom. Take this, Wolfkist, as a sign of friendship. A 
I should you call. The brothers Rangnason will come. You honor me, Uber. See that? Sly bastard trying to win your heart. Well, two can play at that game. How kind of you, Ebar. My pleasure. Our friendship is the best thing to come from this mess. Maybe Chelbert too. A brave little twig. That is good to hear. Now then, Leofrid said there are hunters after me. Sellers. If I don't clear my name, I will be marked for death. I should head to Venomous. Look soon in Smoke and ashes now. That should get those salads off my back. Ah, okay. So I can still take them out. But they're not going to hunt me. Alright. Let's head back to Raventhorpe. a few new ones for you. May I see your stores?
that all for now? I must be on my way now. Goodbye. So long. Glad to see you made it, Chelbat. Thanks to Sigurd, he was a good guide and even better company. He told me some incredible stories. The best ones were about you. Hopefully nothing too embarrassing. There were a few gems. Not to interrupt, Davor, but what of Leicestershire? The Alliance is one. The sons of Ragnar are friends to our clan. Glad to hear it. Well done to you both. Yes, you have a Eivor, a word of note. Someone has set up shop outside. A trader, I believe. When you can, ask him his business here. He seems to represent a larger guild. The child's eyes, or the eyeless children? Eyeless children? No, that cannot be right. Ask him yourself. You have not been long in England, have you? I see by this map you have barely scrapped. New letter. New letter. Yeah. Okay. Go to sleep. Reminds me of Black Flag. I have Ooh, I need. Need to do more raiding. Good day. A new customer. Whether I am or not, I am the one you'll speak with. Randry tells me you are merchants. Ah, hello, hello. Are you the leader of this bustling encampment? We come on behalf of a thousand eyes, vendors of uncommon goods and exotic treasures from all corners of the world. If you need it, we have it. If we don't have it, you don't need it. Such is our pledge. I see. And is this child with you? Child? 
child. My friend, you look upon the master of the thousand eyes, the head of our guild, a legend, a hero of the people, and the richest merchant west of the Indus. You look upon Reda! He means you? He does, Eivor Wolfkist. It is a pleasure to meet you at last. How have you come to know me? The Thousand Eyes have one thousand years as well, and word travels fast. Okay. And what is it I can do for you, or you for me? It's quite simple. For a fee, I can connect you to a shadow market that stretches from the dunes of Egypt to the moors of England. What sort of fee? It varies with the item, but there is a small hitch. Through this market, all prices are paid in opal. Interesting. What a strange color it has. May I hold it? You may hold it and keep it, Eivor. A gift from Reda for your immeasurable hospitality. Now look here. Browse what wares I have on offer. Nothing for now? No matter. My selection changes daily. You will soon find something you like. Now that you are friends with me, you are also a friend of the Thousand Eyes as well. And what does this mean? Observe my outfit, not the scarf I wear. As you travel, you will meet many of my associates clad in these same vestments. These are my people, my other eyes. Seek them out for trade or contracts. Oblige them, and you will earn a tidy sum. And I might even feel inclined to reward you myself. An interesting offer. Good to hear. Now, if you'll excuse us, my apprentice has a tent to secure. You're staying for a while, I suppose. Oh, yes, and you needn't even thank me. We would be honored to call this our home. Good day. Okay. Interesting. You look well today, Eivor. I have to go. Then go in peace. What are you doing in here? Uh, Eivor! We need your help! Who is we? S Sylvie and Ira are in trouble. We went into the woods and... and... There's no time to explain. You need to come with me. Are they all right? No. They're hurt. And badly. Take me to them. Oh my gosh, now I'm obliged to do this. <laughs> Where are they? Not far. We need to hurry. What happened? Are they still in danger? Not if we get there soon. Which way now? This way. We're almost there. Come on, Eivor! Can't you run any quicker? Knut, you have to tell me what has happened. I can't. You won't understand. Even if I do, just, just trust me. I think he did it! Shh, shh. You 
did it! You brought Eivor! Good work, Knut! What is this about? Sorry, Eivor. We had to trick you. But it wasn't my idea. It was Ira's. Lying is not a good way to get my attention, children. But we found a dog that needs your help. She's caught in a trap down there. We thought you wouldn't come if you knew it was just a dog. Oh. That is not the sound of a dog, Ira. That is a wolf. But a wolf is a kind of dog, yes? My mother told me that. Of course it's a kind of a dog. Listen to that sound. Abu! Your dog. Eivor, if you won't help us free her, we must do it ourselves. There's no need. Let me see what I can do. We must help her. She could be starving. Poor her. She is crying! We have to help! Show me what lies ahead. Key to the front door. I must be cautious opening it. I'll free that wolf and pray to Tear that I needn't slay it in front of the children. The table is set. They never made it home. At least his end came quickly. These skulls bear teeth marks. The wolf must have helped him take them down. Deceived by children and shouting at wolves. I was a warrior once. Are you all right? Did you see the wolf? Yes, you freed her. You're amazing, Eivor. But she ran away and didn't even say thank you. She's going back to her family, maybe. Her mom and dad were probably very scared. Or her wolf husband. Maybe her wife. We don't know. But we do know it is time to get you three back to the settlement, before your parents think you were eaten by wolves. Oh, all right. Chin up, Knut. You were very brave today. All of you. In future, you should not be exploring the woods alone, you understand? But you go off on your own all the time. Because I am very wise, and you have a lot to learn. Yes, but there are three of us. That balances everything. That is not quite how it... Oh, more wolves! And not our new friend! Eivor! Stand back! <laughs> That at all. We should name her Mouse. That makes no sense. I think we should call her Chewy because she chews things. What do you think, Eivor? Oh my gosh. Really? That's a choice. She's one of those three. 
The Wolfka. It has an absurd sound, just like all of this. She's our best friend. Now we need to get home. All five of us. Fine. We only wanted to have an adventure like you, Eivor. And we did! And we got a new friend! Part of adventuring is learning a good lesson. Did you know that? Yes, the boring part. Well, have you children learned anything about wild animals today? Hmm, maybe. Yes, befriend them at any cost. They are perfect companions and very kind. My mother always told me to avoid wild animals. Shows what she knows. How about we think quietly on what we have learned? Just until we get home? I think she's quite fond of you. I know she is. We saved her. She'd be rotting away by now. Just like that boar you killed, Eivor. You saw that? We see everything. Let's not tell your parents, all right? Now scamper off home and take your new friend with you. gonna end it before that but now we'll end the episode here um, so thanks for watching and as always remember to uh, like the video leave a comment and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one